that I told them like right away, like, hey, I feel like myself. And then from there, I was able to do everything. Um, I think if people, if people struggle the first day, then the second day is kind of it's a it's a ramp up. So. People go on the COVID list and they start thinking, okay, who's going to be able to play and who's going to mm -hmm. be in my lineup, things like that. But sometimes maybe people forget that, that you guys really suffered, uh, you know, with, the, with this COVID as well. Yeah. Transaction. Yeah, no. Um, yeah, I mean, we're, we're in such a weird business. Like, there's, a, there's, a, there's been a couple of times throughout the year where I'm like, wow, like, I'm an NFL player. Like, pretty much, like, we're playing in a stadium and there's, however many thousand people cheering us on like we're gladiators like that in itself is a, is a strange p profession so i think it is what it is you know i i treat it i treat it as you know it is what it is elijah when you prepare for this dolphins team this week um, just on the opposite side and what would you see weapon wise obviously a, a guy in two others come along pretty well and, yeah and a weapon he likes is that yeah i think i think uh you know they're feeding 17 the rock a lot he's he's had a heck of a Heck of a year as a rookie. Uh, the offense is creative and getting him the ball, and then they're also uh, looking to set up Tua with some um, with some throws, getting the ball out of his hands quickly, and then uh, building confidence off of that. So they're, you know, obviously they're on a roll. They're on, you know, they're they're a good team. They got a great defense on their side too. So um, it's going to be a good challenge.